What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 2K20 My Team coins, head on over to NBAsafe.com and use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout. What's up, guys? If you want cheap, fast, and reliable MT and need to get 12 and 0 done, make sure to head up my second sponsor, Rose NBA, on Twitter for a quick, fast, and reliable purchase. If you're looking to buy a stacked NBA 2K account with max badges and more, visit SportsTMB.com. He has been in the community for years and has hundreds of reviews. Click the first link in the description to get your account today. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back with another NBA 2K20 MyC video. And guys, today, thank you guys so much for 7,000 like subs, bro. That actually means so much. Shout out to all those people that viewed the locker code. It looks like that locker code video blew up and everyone was subbing since then, man. If we're if you're watching this video, man. Please make sure to keep dropping those subs. That would be greatly appreciated. Like, I seriously need the subs. Let's get the 10K, bro. We're 3K off. We are on the journey. Make sure to drop that like, bro. 100 likes on the video for empty giveaways. And we're going to do it on Twitter. So make sure to follow my Twitter down below. That would be greatly appreciated. Literally, guys, thank you so much for the support. It's been absolutely insane. But without further ado, man, let's get into this video. We got some stuff to talk about. We got some market talk, and then after this, we're going to do a triple threat online empty making method, because I've been seeing triple threat has been absolutely amazing. So, we're going to do that. Um, hopefully, I get a lot of views on it, but uh, we'll see. Um, without further ado, man, let's talk about the market. So, if you guys don't know, markets weirdly crashed in different ways, in some ways, and I'm going to explain. So, first off, man, this KD has dropped around 80K since the other day, since two Thursday or Friday, I don't know. Whenever they dropped the Prime, he has dropped a ton. Giannis is actually up. I'm gonna go over some cards. I'm gonna tell you guys what to do right now and how to make MT. So personally, this Giannis card is still one of the best cards in the game. Everybody's been using this card. I don't know why. Because I do have this Giannis. I don't know. Okay, forget it. There's a lot of stuff to talk about, and honestly, I don't even know what to do anymore. So yesterday I saw two lances going for a buyout so remember if you guys remember in my video i told you guys spotlight sim pink diamond um buyout is probably one of the best snipe filters um i actually picked up two lance stevenson's for a hundred thousand and ninety thousand and his price is going for around 130 so i'm gonna make around thirty thousand plus mt on clean off two of them so now this one's 110 with a minute left honestly i think he could sell for 120 and some sold for a 140 yesterday. I got one for 100k, one for 90k. I'm gonna wait it out a little bit. I don't know if these cards have a lot, but yo, that snipe filter is straight cash. These are gone in three days. I guess Tuesday they'll drop more content. That snipe filter is money. Spotlight Sim Pink Diamond. Obviously, Spotlight Sim Diamond. There's another insane snipe filter. Um, these are pretty much. I'm just gonna make this video empty methods and whatnot. Um, I'm gonna have another snipe filter video tomorrow, so I'm just gonna leak out some snipe filters from the video. I'm gonna post tomorrow, dude. Isaac Bonga snipe filter. Shout out to my boy Charlie Scott on freaking Twitter. He's the goat. Um, he also won the giveaway. Isaac Bonga, bro, snipe filter is supposedly straight cash. He said he made hundreds of thousands off this snipe filter. So if you guys wanna make that empty, man. Um, definitely stay on this filter. I guess it was hotter yesterday, but it still might not be hot today. This snipe filter is obviously goaded because this Isaac Bonga card is goaded. So if you sell this filter, it's probably hot or less competition than usual. And you could make a ton of MT off it. So I would 100% recommend this filter. Obviously it's good. Oh, right there. Give me that. Oh, I botched it. Oh, look at that. We would have made 4k right there. So shout out to my boy. That is obviously one of the best snipe filters in the game i literally would have made 4k in one minute and i botched it so that's on my end 800 isaac bongo when he's going for 4900 like whoever did that is an idiot whoever did that has issues so right there man that's night filter obviously money all right so we're gonna head on to some some talk some market talk and all that good stuff um let's see so if you guys do remember a lot of opals are going for the low a lot are going for cheap so i just want to talk about one thing in this game so if you guys have the prime set done and you have galaxy opal big o this big o card i feel like may rise soon because i think kg could honestly match up with taco kg is actually really that good so i don't know it's up to you let me know how it goes this bowl bowl card has got to be on sooner or later but yo right now if you want to pick up caruso 
I think it's a good time. He's a budget opal for the low price of around. He was 130k. He did rise. And by the way, I got the free opal. If you guys don't know, um, this card right here. I don't know, man. I don't know, man. This card is obviously good, but I think you might want to pick him up. I think he might go up to like 200,000 plus. We shall see. Also, man, people were talking about Paul George going up and down, not listening to me again. I don't know, man. That's not my fault. I told you guys to sell at a certain time. It affects some. So if you guys remember, Paul George in my video, I think yesterday, two days ago, was around 110K. I kind of warned you guys. Then again, I posted five videos yesterday. Um, This car was at 110K. He has rose a ton. So if you have him, Honestly, I would wait till tomorrow to sell. I think he might rise even more. This card's obviously really good. A lot of people love Paul George. Um, I would honestly wait it off. He might go up in value. Does he have Hall of Fame range? I don't think he does. He doesn't. Um, but yo, this card's really good. He is actually so loved by the community, and he keeps going up and down. So, looks like when a Mark Crash comes, this card drops a ton, and then he goes right back up. But like I said, man, if you want a really good Snipe Filter right now... Another snipe filter that only includes one person if you have the MT4 is straight up Minute Bow, bro. I sniped out 20 of them yesterday. I sat on this filter for about an hour when the packs first dropped. And he was pouring out for 50k, 60k. I was sound up for 75 in seconds. This card, man, he's one of my favorite cards in the game. If you didn't check out my gameplay, make sure to go check him out. This snipe filter, bro, is straight baller, bro. It is straight bulla. It's so good. Everybody's been balling on the snipe filter. My subs have been balling on the snipe filter. Make sure to get them for 55k or less. And you'll ball out. And if you don't want to sell them, you want to keep them. 55k is a great price to keep. He was around 75 yesterday. Like right there. If I wanted to keep him, I would buy that crap. And I would I would simply keep him. 57k for a 7-7 seven, seven tallest dude in the game, bro. We're talking about a 7-7 seven, seven center that greens three-pointers because he's cheese. I literally played triple throw online with him. And he's absolutely cheese. Another method for you guys. So the Isaac Bong and the Bull are really good. The Bull Bong Marjanovic are good. If he's still around 20,000 MT, that's another really good snipe filter. Um, pretty much, bro. Any one of these cards are going to be good besides the Opals. Like, consistently wise, I would say the Isaac Bong and the Bull Bong. But the Manu Bull could be quick, fast money as well. So it's up to you, man. I go by the tiers. Brian Scalabrine's obviously good too. That's a snipe right there, I think. I don't know. Is it? Ah, uh, not really. You know what? I'm just going to keep him anyways. 18,000 MT. I get something for 20. Honestly, this night filter might be golden. Not going to lie. This night filter does look pretty good. I just got one for 18K my first try. He's going for around 20. Not a double at all. I'm going to make my MT back. But you guys understand. If you see one in the first minute, it's obviously going to be money. And I'm honestly just breaking down the market for you. If you guys have some stuff to sell, you guys have Wade, you have Kristaps to sell. I'm going to give you my outtake on that right now in this video because I know a lot of you guys were wondering, what do I do, bro? Like, what do I do with Kristaps and stuff? Like, bro, I'm going to tell you right now. So we got, I think it's Prime 2 VIP here, a Prime Series 2, not Prime Series 2, is it? Uh, here it is. So my take, I'm going to say wait, but you know, it's kind of hard to wait considering the fact that Opal KD and Ben Simone's and took all the value of this set. So I don't know, man. It's totally up to you at this point. I'm confused myself. I would wait, but then again, they're only pink diamonds. They're not going to last that long. And Kristaps already has a 98, and Wade has an Opal. So we'll see how long that lasts. Honestly, bro, I'm just sitting here. I'm kind of confused on what to do myself. Like, the market's up, the market's down. The market's up, the market's down. I have Simmons. Do I sell Simmons? Like, I don't know what to do myself. I'm honestly confused. So I'm just going to sit on those snipe filters that I just released for you guys. And you guys should be able to ball out on those. Like, literally... Probably my best tips is those snipe filters right now. Obviously, picking up the cheap cards. Obviously, just sniping, really. Like, honestly, right now is really not a great time to invest because I feel like another market crash is going to come. And I feel like since it's endgame, the market might just continue to drop and drop and drop. So, honestly, if you have Opal Simmons and Durant, I might have to recommend you guys selling them. But I'm not totally sure. I will let you know in later videos. I might sell mine because it seems like a good time to. But yeah, really, other than that, that's all I got. Hop on the bongo snipe filter. Type in those locker codes. Hope you guys really enjoyed, man. Thank you for 7K. Make sure to smash that like button and help your boy out. Hope you guys enjoyed. Have a good one. Stay tuned for content later. Peace, man. Peace.